One of the things I've learned over the years of inspecting homes at the million dollar, three million dollar, five million dollar mark is business people expect a high level of business from the real estate agent. And really they're engaging in a business conversation even though they're purchasing a home. That's a difficult conversation for many real estate agents. I've got Chris Beyer from Caldwell Banker Vanguard with me today who has uh, quite a business experience and background here in the community and uh, really specializes in finding business level homes for high-end business people here in town. Chris, welcome yeah. to the show. Hello, thank you, thank you, Wally, appreciate it. You know, I, I've noticed uh, in, in dealing at that one, two, three, five million dollar mark, uh, most of the buyers at that level seem to have very little time and they expect those communications to be very, very crisp. What, what is your own experience? I'll tell you, my background, I have a Fortune 500 background. I'm used to dealing at you know, C-suite level uh, folks and um, I know how to communicate with them. And so I treat it really very much, very much the same. I'm, I'm adding usually wives into the conversation, <laughs> that sort of thing. So I might soften a little bit, but uh, I mean, it's personable, but very businesslike. And, uh, and so you try to capture all the points. You really have to keep in mind how they're thinking and, and answering, uh, you know, you know be, be anticipative of the questions that they're going to ask. Yeah, I found also it's almost like a commercial building buyer. Very often a person buying a home at that one to five or more million dollar mark, they've bought a lot of commercial buildings right. and they experience and express that ex much the same way they did in commercial. A absolutely. I mean, there's, there's, um, um, there, there's, there's definitely some similarities in, in, in maybe what the way, and you, and you do have to balance it because there's a commercial type of aspect to it where it's objective. It's like, you know, what am I getting for my money? That sort of thing. But at the same time, it's very personal. And there's plenty of people who are going to be living in that house that really care about the feel of that house. And I'll tell you on commercial, it's the same thing. Commercial, it, you know, people say commercial is all about, you know, return on investment or price per square foot. But really, even on the commercial side, it's about, you know, what, what, what does the place feel like? You know, your employees have to come there every day. So you, you do have to be cognizant, even of the, the, soft, the soft things. Right. You know, I, I look back on my uh, Navy background, Navy pilot in a previous life, and had the opportunity, I was on several different admiral staffs, mm -hmm. and, and most captains of industry communicate much the same way aircraft carrier captains did, admirals did. It's, it's very succinct, succinct mm -hmm. it's very to the point, and really being able to make rapid decisions so that you're thin, thin slicing the data that you've given them. Right, right. I mean, you bullet point things, they like to be presented options, um, uh, of, you know, good, objective, thoughtful, researched options and uh, allow them to choose. And then, and then what's nice is they go for it. You know, it's not, you don't just, you just don't stew on the decision so much. <laughs> I also discovered they tend to tolerate excuses very poorly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. And, 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 and it's the way I hand, I've always handled things is, you know, if I, if I make an error, don't think about something, I definitely, I mean, I own up to it right away too, but so don't, don't excuse yourself. Uh, you know, just apologize, move forward and fix it. And really the same things carry down at, at every level of house. Um, everyone wants information. Everyone wants to know mm -hmm. that they're with a person that they can trust and has the experience to do it. So that part doesn't differ. But I did find that there's a little bit less emotion mm -hmm. and a lot more expectation of, uh, of particulars and accuracy. Right. Ab absolutely. And they, they they want you know they want great service through it. They want a very professional job. You know, want a great home inspection. <laughs> you know, they're not. You know, they're they're a lot of. I time, know a guy yeah, for that. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I got a guy. I got a guy. <laughs> I appreciate yeah, that. Yeah. Chris, I thank you for being with us. I always enjoy spending time with you. If you'd like to learn more about Chris Byers and his specialties at Caldwell Banker Vanguard, you can get all his contact information at jacksonvillebuzz.com. Stay with us. Right back.